Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. My name is Kate Lind and today we're making cauliflower rice. It's gonna be simple, easy, and painless. So let's get started. Usually I have more of motivational and inspirational videos, but I love cauliflower rice so much that I wanted to make this video for you guys. And I used to do a whole bunch of cooking videos before and everybody's been telling you, please bring back those cooking videos. So here is one for you guys. So here we go. simple and it's so healthy for you. So I'm going to dice this up really finely. And I have a pan over there just waiting for me. And I'm going to throw these onions in and cook them down until they're about translucent. translucent. Now if you do not have onions right now, considering the situation, or if you just don't like onions, you don't have to throw them in. I just like the taste and I feel like it really enhances the rice, but it's totally up to you. Maybe a little bit more. Ooh, my olive oil is burning up our hair. Okay, I got my onions. Okay, throwing my onions in here. Smells good already. All right, so I'm gonna give this a stir. And you can throw some garlic in here right about now. It really just depends on you and what you like. So these are cooking pretty fast because I have them on medium, but I'm gonna throw in my bags right now and get these in here. Guys, this only has cauliflower and this particular type has garlic, lemon peel, and parsley. But if you don't have the time or if you just don't want to, I mean, sometimes we just do not want to be cutting up and shredding all and ricing all of that cauliflower. So just get these bags and it's literally just cauliflower. Rice, just as you would rice it yourself. So. I'm actually going to put some more, a little bit more olive oil in here. And it's gonna be so quick. Throw this in here. Make sure you get all that good stuff out. Oh, I can smell the lemon. I've never had this before, but this is all they had at the grocery store. I usually only get the one that has either garlic in it or I get the plain and I'll put garlic in myself. So I never had this before. This will be interesting. And I'm gonna go and get my other bag as well. It's okay if there is still frozen pieces in there. Don't worry about that. Cause they're gonna soften up really quickly. And we want this on like medium to medium high because you do not, you want to cook this quick and you don't want to make the rice mushy because it's already in small little pieces. So think about it. There's not much cooking time and that's it. I'm going to put the lid on top and let it cook for about a couple minutes. Then after a couple minutes, all I'm going to do is start give it a stir. Put the lid on top again, and then let it cook for about three more minutes. And then we're pretty much done. I might throw in some butter in between those stirs, but that is it. So yeah, it's awesome. All right guys, I'm gonna let this cook, and I will see you guys in about two to three minutes. Hey, we're back, and I got some butter right here. Just about 
a tablespoon of butter and it's been about three minutes and I'm just going to put that in. I'm going to give it a stir to make sure that just about every side of these cauliflower pieces are hitting the bottom of the pan. And, yep. So easy guys, another three minutes and we're just about done. I would recommend that you give yours a taste, see if you need some pepper, some salt, um, some anything, any seasoning you want. Another great thing is you can make it into a risotto or a rice pilaf or um, anything just by maybe adding some cream. Another great idea, which I've done before and it was amazing, is make it like in pork fried rice or chicken fried rice and add some like scrambled eggs in it. Awesome. You can barely tell you guys, I'm just telling you. Another great option is to add, even if you're, if you or somebody you know is on the fence with making this cauliflower rice, all you need to do then you can kind of warm it up to it by just adding like about a cup of rice or something like that. And that will kind of help them ease into it because you can't tell as much. But honestly guys, even if you don't do that, it is extremely good. You can barely tell, like I said in the beginning, I gave it to my husband and he couldn't even tell. So, and even to this day when he knows it's cauliflower rice, he loves it. He would almost rather some days eat this rice than actual rice just because it's healthier and he doesn't feel as guilty. And I feel the same way. So it is a must try. You guys got to try it if you haven't already. Baby, it was. rice before. Let me bring you guys some closer. It's good. It sure is lemony though. I love lemon. I'm like a huge lemon fan, but it's really lemon. Good. I just wish they had original because the lemon flavor one is really uh it's strong it has a strong lemon flavor it's still good though but yeah i think i might add some a little bit salt a little bit pepper uh, maybe some fresh parsley that would be really good this would be great with some like rotisserie chicken the lemon flavor i think would go well very well with that great stuff guys <laughs> but yeah i love this dish look at that i love it kinds so easy very simple like i said you can grind this up blend it up and make your own i've done it many times i probably will do it many more times before but for the sake of this video and for time using those bags if you're not in the mood to cook or if you just am not in the mood to shred up some cauliflower which is very easy only takes a couple minutes but those little baggies are very very handy and healthy like I said most of them and I think I've never seen a bag that doesn't have more than just cauliflower if you're getting the original and if you get a flavored one then they have like cauliflower and rosemary cauliflower and garlic different flavors but there's no added ingredients in there I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe because I enjoyed making it for you guys and let me know if you make it down below. Let me know if you've already had it before and you really, really like it. Let me know your thoughts. If you have any new recipes, I would love to hear about them. But that is it for today's video. So I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.